Ben Affleck and Lindsay Shukas check out an $18.5 million property in the Santa Monica Mountains as they hunt for first home together just three months after going public. They went public as a couple in July. And Ben Affleck and Lindsay Shukas seem to be getting pretty serious after just three months in the limelight. The 45-year-old actor was house hunting in the west side of Los Angeles on Tuesday as he brought along his 37-year-old girlfriend according to TMZ. The very impressive eight-bedroom, ten-bathroom home sits on 9,422 square feet and was just built this year as it is listed by Houghton Party Plus Partners. According to sources for the TMZ, it seems like the two were enamored by the property as they stayed for more than an hour. Their insider added that Lindsay was holding onto the listing sheet as they left the potential new pad. That was not the only property the couple checked out according to TMZ as they also looked at a Pacific Palisades and Brentwood properties, each worth $12 million. It has yet to be revealed if Ben will be living on his own or if Lindsay will be joining him. Lindsay isn't the only supportive woman by the Argo actor's side. Ex-wife Jennifer Garner, 45, was spotted chatting and laughing with Ben on Monday as he dealt with the fallout of his 2003 groping scandal. The couple were married for almost 10 years and raised daughters Violet, 11, and Serafina, 8, and son Samuel, 5, together. Earlier this year Ben had moved out of the guesthouse at the Pacific Palisades property he had owned with Jennifer. The actor has been in hot water in recent days after former One Tree Hill star and MTV correspondent Hilary Burton claimed the actor groped her during a TRL appearance in 2003. Hilary made her allegations just hours after Ben took to Twitter to condemn disgraced movie mogul Harvey Weinstein for his alleged sexual assault and harassment scandal. Former Weinstein protege Ben said he was saddened and angry over the sickening claims. His statement was slammed by a number of people, including Weinstein accuser actress Rose McGowan, who called Ben a liar. Ben was quick to reply, tweeting, I acted inappropriately toward Ms. Burton and I sincerely apologize. The same day makeup artist Anna Marie Tendler took to Twitter to claim that Ben grabbed her asterisk asterisk at a Golden Globes party in 2014 and demanded an apology. The actor and director has been focusing on his sobriety after a full-time rehab stint in February, which came before he went public with his alcohol addiction in March. He wrote on Facebook at the time, I have completed treatment for alcohol addiction. Something I've dealt with in the past and will continue to confront. I want to live life to the fullest and be the best father I can be.